Do you smell what The Rock is cooking? I'm always good with everybody until they come wrong. It's like a lot of these Rudy Poop sportscasters I will not talk to, like Chris Carter, the little dude Nick, the other guy, uh, Shannon Sharp. I'm putting all of them on my bypass lips, so you might be the only one talking to me. Well, I'm the only one here. Well, I'm talking to the only one here. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm going back. When I go back to the state, they can't talk to me ever again. Cause they Rudy Poop and they fakes. Rudy Poop. Rudy Poop. Rudy Poop. I said they Rudy Poops and fakes. They know who they are. I don't know what Rudy Poop means. Rudy Poop means. You don't have to, good, you don't know what that means. Ask Chris Carter, he know what it means. The dude that he hosts with, Nick, he knows what it means. Because they both really cool. Push them to the side. They have no clue. And all these other dumb sportscasters who say, oh, I feel bad that the boy, boys are going over there. No, you don't. You still can go home and sleep with me. You just want something to say on TV. And Charles Barkley, too. He, he's in the same boat. Tell him he need to go to a place further away where nobody had to talk to him. Because nobody wants to talk to Charles because he's dumb. I like Chuck. I'm a Chuck fan. Hey, Listen. you be a Chuck fan. I used to be a Chuck fan until he started talking stupid. When he started talking stupid, guess what? He got to go. But he's wishy-washy, too, and I call him Rudy Poop, too. And one thing I didn't like, uh, we went to a Lakers game and tried to shake my hand. But don't talk bad about me and you shake my hand. I'd rather you just be mean the whole time. But don't be fake. A lot of these guys are fake, and I don't like that at all.